Sean Tate in the red corner. And the best the representing Trumbull Park. Let's hear it for Tyree Burr. Tyree Burr, blue corner, representing Trumbull Park. Where is Trumbull Park? Is that the south side or? No, no, it's uh, near Humboldt Park. Is it? Wow, I didn't know they had a boxing ring. Well, you know, it's not as active as it used to be. Okay. Bird in the red. And Tate in the blue. Bird in the blue. You mean Bird in the blue and Tate in the red. And here we got, yeah, yeah. we got Tate having Bird against the corner. Lots of punches thrown. Dr. David Smith as a ref. Also one of the best chiropractors in the world. Takes care of a lot of these young boxers. Now Bird switches to southpaw. See if he gets something going with that. Ooh, low blow. A little bit low, a little bit low. Tate's the aggressor. Ooh, he might have got caught, but he's not going to call it. He calls it a white belt. I thought Tate did enough to win the first round. Well, that'll be interesting to see because um, both fighters were uh, trying to feel each other out. And, it was, uh, yeah, true. I only had two goals, is to become a boxer on the big screen and do a Super Bowl commercial. And um, I did both within th two years. And I did a Super Bowl commercial with uh, Antoine Fuqua last year, 2016, in Michelob Ultra. And uh, I got a boxing movie called Gun coming out um, April 26th at the Chinese Theater, Beverly Hills Film Festival. So it's what interesting. What brings you back to Chicago? Uh, I'm a real big fan of the Chicago Golden Glove, being a three-time Chicago Golden Glove champion. Um, uh, I've been helping out jo George Hernandez at uh, Garford Park District with uh, a couple of the fighters. Uh, they call themselves the Dream Team. And um, I've been really back since uh, Ed Brown got murdered in, oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. in December. And I've been spending a lot more time in Chicago. And um, it hurt me a lot. So. Who knows if it's God's will, I, I, I would like to open up a gym, you know, in a, on the west side or, you know, get involved a little bit more and get focused in this Golden Glove tournament for next year. Well, that's, that's interesting. I think Humboldt Park is looking for a coach. Oh, really? I think so, yeah. Thank you. Thank you for that. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll definitely look into that. If, if you know anyone over there, that'd be awesome, too. Well, you know Frez Okendo. You know Frez? Yes, I know Frez. He wants to be the coach over there, too. Oh, he deserves it. <laughs> well, he's fighting for the world championship in Hollywood, Florida in June. I think, I think he deserves it. Um, he's from Humble Park, he's yeah. Puerto Rican, and he's fought all over the world. And ev everyone. Yeah, Even I took him to Kazakhstan to fight, and he was so popular that the Kazakhs wanted him to beat the Kazakh. Wow. And he knocked the Kazakh down, and the stadium started going, U-S-A, U-S-A, <laughs> yeah. Well, I actually fought in a Aiba tournament in Kazakhstan, and uh, the chant was a little bit different. It was, kill America, kill America, <laughs> kill America. 
So. Third and final round with Mayshawn Tate and Tariq Bird. Mayshawn Tate is coming hard, coming out strong. Non-stop throwing punches. Red corner lets uh, blue corner out of the corner into the center of the ring. And now he's got him back in the corner, but he lets him out again. He's got to close on blue corner because blue corner has the reach. He's just following him around right now. He's not cutting off the ring. Blue corner has his back against the rope where you never want to be in an amateur boxing match. But uh, Red lets him get away. The, the warning shot. That was a good left hand by Blue. Good fight, good fight. I thought Blue won that round. I think it's a split decision for the Red corner so I was in both boxes. I have a judge's scorecard in this 123-pound senior novice division bout. A winner by a 3-2 split decision and 2017 Chicago Golden Gloves champion, Zawi.